stuff like this right when you come in the woods burn outdoors currently outdoors by the way what the fuck no beds totally spoil it middle of nowhere well obviously not in the middle of nowhere cool rubbish thrown everywhere fucking scumbags It's like a fucking mile and a half walk to get here. Look at that. Arseholes. Absolute arseholes. Pisses me off. In the summer, that's a fire hazard, isn't it? If ever you see one. And one of the worst bits, Lloyd Grossman, nice, is that. Just fucking take it home with you. Wankers. Not very pat. Just gotta make one peg. Peggy! <sighs> yeah, should have brought the knife of bushcraft. Might be perfect though. For the moment, so I can find a banger. Okay, there you go. One hammock set up. It's getting dark quick. It's uh, quarter past three already. But um, inside, usual, uh, what is it? OEX Leviathan, Leviathan 900 sleeping bag, little fake nature hike pillow, all my usual crap underneath, including my pack, a few bits of clothes, food, etc, etc, etc. Not bad pitch actually, quite happy with that. Wind's coming in this direction pretty much all night and it's fairly windy now, a little bit chilly actually. Just to show you the other person set up who I haven't introduced as yet, which I will be shortly. Uh, yes, Burton Outdoors, I am currently outdoors with another YouTuber that you probably will know. Uh, he's donated this particular beerage, which is Brewdog Rattle and Rum. Not my favourite, actually, um, but yeah, it was free. So, and it's seven seven point four percent on the Richter scale, which helps massively with any given situation. A little bit chilly. Um, it was supposed to be like fifteen, sixteen degrees today. I'm not sure it's actually reached to that. It's supposed to be about eleven overnight. I think it's going to be 
colder than that with the wind chill, but it should be warm enough. I'm um, in the one wind hammock, one wind under blanket, DD 3x3 tarp, all the other stuff I've just shown you. Uh, yeah. And we, I haven't set it up with the perfect view actually. There's, there is actually a view a few trees and stuff, but because the wind's coming up this way from the valley, um, I've had to put that side down. So, you know me, I like to look out in the morning rather be restricted on vision. Vision, vision on. Everyone remember vision on? I can't remember what they did in vision on. Is that the guy that had morph in it on vision one? Vision on? I don't know near enough all this bear and I feel a little bit tipsy already anyway here we go oh let me show you the tree of life the tree of life yes it's alive alive over this tree here we go so the tree of life is coming up here we go the tree of life it bears fruit and the secret person who is camping with Mai is... Tim O'Tay. Tim O'Tay, <laughs> shampoo, born outside. Born outside. He was actually born inside, we think. We're not sure that he was born outside. We know the reason why it says he's born outside, spelt B-O-O-U-R-N-E. But we can't divulge that information as to what that means. No, if you know, you know. Because I might come from Shibbon. Yeah. Which is a local but miles away from here. Yeah. How are you, Tim? Not too bad. How are you? Good, yeah. Yeah, good, thanks. Cold? It's getting cold, isn't it? I've got cold hands. Yeah, I've just put my thermals back on. Mm. And, um, I see you're doing a little bit of uh, craft of bush there. Yes, yes. A bit of crafty bush. Yeah. What's that you got on your head? This? Yeah. This is a beanie uh, from Camp Life Bushcraft, don't you know? Shout out Camp Life Bushcraft. Shout out Camp Life Bushcraft. Do I look good in it, Dan, or, do I, or should I be in a head in a box <laughs> living in a box in a cardboard box <laughs> no you do look good in it it suits right. yeah if you look through one eye got another bear these ones are quite nice uh cold town bear porn star martini ale not bad 4.5 on the richter scale go check them out two pounds in sainsbury's on offer obviously people don't like them possibly because it's a little bit girly i don't know but if you're a girly, drink them, because they're quite nice. Uh, anyway, what I was going to say was, shout out your boy, Camp Life Bushcraft. Shout out, CLB. Winter time, not good for filming. We got here quite early. Tim kept pissing about what tree he wanted. He didn't want this tree, didn't want that tree. Oh, I can't hammock off there, there's too much of a drop. Can't hammock there, there's just... There's, Bugs, can't hammock there, there's too many leaves, too many leaves on that tree. He's just pissed about for ages, like an old woman or an old man. Um, he didn't really, it was all my fault. So we deliberated a lot in the big woodland about where we were going to hammock. But I think we chose the right spot in the end. Oh yeah, going back to the light. So this time of year, obviously, you've not got a lot of light. You can't do a lot of filming. I don't like to film a lot anyway. I just like to have a good laugh with my mates. So that's what I'm going to do after cracking this one open. Goodbye. Uh, I can't remember if I've actually filmed any wood, but we have got wood. I have wood every morning without fail. No Viagra included. Um, Tim has done a little fire preppy. Preppy preppy, but there's lots of wood everywhere where the eye can see. There's the man himself, looking suave and sophisticated, blending in with the trees. Different hat on. Different hat on. The other one's a bit warm, isn't it? Yes, that's a very warm hat. That's a nighttime hat, isn't it, yeah, the CLB hat? That's, that's going to be my bedtime hat and dog walking hat. Yeah. Don't you know? It's a good choice. Very. Anyone wants one, you know where to go. Mr CLB. Yeah. Camp Life. Bushcraft. You can also buy them at Outdoor Gear Essentials, I think. Anyway. Oh. You want to show me your penis? Yeah. <laughs> Burn outdoors, currently outdoors. Just about to consume this lovely little bottle of wine that Tim, yes, that man there, <laughs> has purchased for me. Enjoy.
Oh well. Tonight's um, meal of choice <laughs> looks dry. Similar to a fire pot I had before, which was um, pork something. Pork sword. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you always look flushed when you're out with me. Fl flushed? Yeah. Do I? Yeah. Time of life. Mm. Yeah, it's you're going through the mano pause. Flushes, yeah, it's the flushes. Mm. Flushing and, meadows. Mm. So uh, anyway, I'm going to eat it. It looks alright. I um, cooked it for 15 minutes in boiling water. And uh, just having a little sip of that. Mm, watching that. And uh, here we go. I won't uh, bore you with me eating it because it... Mm, a bit steamy, steamy windows. So here we go, we're digging in. Goodbye. Let's give you a parting. Right, I can absolutely say, in all honesty, that was probably the best fire pot meal I've had. Um, I think I've had about maybe five, maybe even six different types. That one extremely extremely tasty and I think it's probably the lesser level one because I've not seen it much beef stew and pearl barley go get one or two or three definite winner definite Michael in my book if you know you know steak steak Oh, that's fucking hot. Steak. Oh, that is just fog. Fog water. So glad I decided to put a tarp up tonight. So glad. Racing spoon. I'll bring both out with me just get the loose one. Mm. But I've got the long long tail. <clears throat> One's an outfit one, I think it's about probably about eight hundred when I got it, and the other one is a non brander. Probably not titanium but feels the same. That's about ten mm. I like outfit stuff. It's damp days like this, cold days, you question your sanity. Why am I doing this? <laughs> yeah. I remember sitting on campsites, you know, proper campsites. Sitting in weather like this. Like me and Karen we used to go camping just with like a two man tent and sitting out in horrible weather. <laughs> Banging. That's one thing I don't like is drinking. I haven't had it for years. Drink so much. Yeah, I don't know. What? Whiskey. Whiskey. 
the hat the hangover. The scariest thing in these woods is that old woman type thing sitting there with her arms crossed it looks like to me watching us sitting by the tree with a stick in her hand Ooh, hang on i'll get a bit closer really spooky do you agree jimmy saw it on um i think uh, tim's photo yesterday on his instagram and tim's just noticed it across the woods <laughs> noticed they're looking at us Hopefully all you guys can see that and make it out. Scary. Don't they look good? Don't the hammocks look good in this environment today? Uh, there's Tim's setup. Tim had a little bit of an issue with his... Oh, you can see all the water on it, actually. A lot of water on his net for some reason, which we don't know what it is, because I haven't got any on mine at all. But... <clears throat> Yeah, good little spot actually. Nice and warm. No complaints. I'll drop the tarp down a little bit later when I got into bed. Uh, yeah, not bad little woodland at all. So now waiting for uh, Mr. Bourne outside to finish his pack down. Here we go. He always seems to take an absolute <laughs> age. Probably longer than uh, Dan from Camp Life Bushcraft. He actually takes quite a while as well. I'm all packed, all done, ready to rock. That's why I leave my chair till last. I can sit down and watch other people, which is what I do mainly anyway. <laughs> like watching people sawing, watching people gathering wood, watching people make fires. It's handy being me. Right, here we are. <clears throat> Look at my slightly uh, enlarged face. Tim looks like a midget, not got an enlarged face. <laughs> good night, yeah, Tim. Good night, really good night. Nice to be out again. It was very nice to mm. be out, and uh, our setups actually look pretty good in this gloomy weather this morning, which is about eight o'clockish, is it? Half eight, something like that. Yeah, yeah. Something like that. But um, yeah, it was a really good night. 8. Nice. Fifty-two. Oh, crikey! Better get off then. Probably need a poo-poo soon. <laughs> um, <laughs> so we're off now, and um, thanks very much for watching. Burn Outdoors, currently outdoors with Mr. Bourne outside. Go check his channel out. I'll leave a link in the description as normal. Goodbye. See you later, Tim. <laughs> Not bad, actually. Had one the other week. Not too strong. 4.5 on the Richter scale.